Rodeo fans in Watertown are saddling up for some pro rodeo this weekend. Kelloland's Ariana Schumacher tells us what to expect. Good morning, Ariana. Good morning, Sarah. Watertown will be welcoming its first professional rodeo event in around 30 years to the newly renovated Derby Downs Rodeo Grounds. They will bring in athletes who compete at a professional level from multiple states. The goal is to continue bringing pro athletes in this sport to Watertown, not just the pro rodeo, but through camps, clinics, uh, different things like that that we can hopefully involve the kids in. Having a pro rodeo event will also draw in other people to the community and bring in more revenue for local businesses. They'll come and they'll eat at our restaurants and they'll drink beer at our bars and they'll stay at our hotels and they'll just pump money into the local economy. But more than that, it'll build for the next year and the year after that is what I'm hoping for. I think it definitely means a lot to the community. Hopefully bring some money to the community, but more importantly, money into Derby Downs and we can keep the updating this facility. There's a lot of future projects we want to do out here and want to continue not just growing the sport on this side of the state, but growing it in Watertown. They're hoping these rodeo events entertain the community while also inspiring the future generation of rodeo contestants. I think anytime you can see a pro athlete compete in the sport that you're passionate about or you're in favor of uh, only generates more excitement and more fun for everybody involved. Bringing the entire community together to enjoy the state's sport. Because I really do think that there's a lot of people here who uh, want to see rodeo. I can be one of them. i have not anyone who I think I've been to one rodeo in my life but I will come here because this is fantastic for Watertown. Well you can see the rodeo for yourself this Friday and Saturday beginning at 7 p.m. Ticket information can be found in this link or the link in this story at kewoland.com.